So I was sitting here because I'm literally leaving my house soon to go get my children. And I was just thinking like, I had a revelation. <laughs> I'm getting old. <laughs> and I was thinking like, wow, I'm already mid thirties and I'm about to be hitting 40. And the next thing you know, we're going to be 50, 60 and dead. So I say this to say, um, live your life guys and live it to the fullest. Be happy, uh, live with no regrets and, you know, keep your circle small and, um, yeah, I was just, I was just sitting here thinking, pondering as a mom, cause I just realized I was getting old. Um, sorry, you know, I can't do things, two things at one time, I'm looking at my damn hair, seeing how long it's gotten. Um, but yeah, message of the day, live your best life. Peace. April, you're Asian. I know your circle is small, but is it sideways? Nah, I'll just mess with y'all. Y'all know that that's just a myth. But here's the thing, right? So April the Baddest Jones, in my personal opinion, is allegedly, possibly, maybe going through a midlife hoe crisis. She is out here up on the Instagram telling y'all to go ahead and, and live without regrets. You know, live life to the fullest. You know, just go out here and basically be trash. Giving hoes bad advice as if they need any, right? Because uh, this is what these heifers have been doing. I mean, this is what people do. Have y'all ever noticed that when anybody says something like, you know, live your life? to the fullest that never means anything positive nobody's like live your life to the fullest and do cancer research solve cancer you know what i mean uh, you live your life to the fullest go make a billion dollars and then just give it all away nope they're like live your life to the fullest to find you some mean three and a half to glide up and down on live your life to the fullest and drink some you know what i mean always something negative uh, you know uh, basically Go out and party and uh, hop in the bed with people, bed hop like a bed bug. You know what I mean? Stuff like that. They don't mean that in a positive way. And I know what some of y'all are thinking like me. As much as you love hoes, like, uh, why are you even saying this at all? Listen, let me tell you something. I'm a bad person and I love hoes, right? Because that's just who I am. I'm not going to tell you that that's what you need to do. I'm not going to tell you to have the same bad habits that I do. If anything, I'm going to tell you that your best bet is to not be like me because I like broken women. Not so that I can break the house somehow, but so that I can build her up and let her know how important she is. But that's just the way that I am. I'm like a psychologist to these hoes. I'm like ho coach. You know what I mean? I, I, I be telling them like, look, like, do you understand that just because you had a hundred mean three and a halves, that doesn't mean that doesn't mean that you're worthless, baby. That just means that you made some mistakes and you went out here and did some wild five. Don't, 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 don't. Do, 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 do any of y'all know that song? I know some of y'all like me. You really brought it back. But it, 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 the point is this, though, my lord. I like some wild chicas. That's just what. Listen, I like chicks who are n not wild. I like chicks who are wild. I, I, listen, if you bad, you bad. You know what I mean? But at the same token, I'm not going to tell these girls to go out here and do some some whole stuff. But if that's who you are, then it is what it is. And here's my thing about the house. As much as I love them, some of them are doing it wrong. And when April started saying that mess about messing with the game, I mean, see, that that's that's doing it. That's home wrong. That is uh, that is whole backpedaling you know what i mean like that that's <laughs> that's hoeing in reverse that's owen not home he's a loser the last dude she should be uh talking about giving her time to is some clown like that i mean he owes this woman over seven million dollars if if you <laughs> i'm talking about the beautiful priscilla rainey who was one of the contestants on his sh on his show she got game and i think it was 2015 and i mean do y'all know what he was accused of yeah but anyways the point is this though the point is this though he's the the one of the last men that she should be out here so, look at doja cat doja cat was up on instagram acting like 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 a crazy person and talking about how she was gonna smash Russ but why why Be because you think that he's attractive or well, I mean I know the real reason why because Doja Cat is a bimbo and she's obsessed with milk complected men but you know it, it is it is it is what it is it is what it is 
And, you know, <laughs> but yeah, man, see, hoeing backwards. She's owing, not hoeing, you know what I mean? And I, I like thoughts. So, you know, if I have something negative to say about uh, something that a woman's doing, then it there must be something wrong with it. Because once again, y'all know what I love. And that's a good hoe. But anyways, I think that April is having a midlife hoe crisis. She's out here because you, you know that a hoe is having a midlife hoe crisis when they say things like, Hey, y'all, I'm thotting it up and botting it up, and you need to do it, too. And she didn't say it just like that, but we all know what she's alluding to. She's not telling y'all, you know, to go feed hungry orphans in Croatia. She's not telling you, you know what I mean, anything positive. Uh, go over uh, to to Russia and, and knit blankets for poor Russian Eskimos. You know what I mean? Like, that's not what she's talking about homeless Russian Eskimos. She's not talking about saving that particular group of people. I mean, if they exist at all. But, you know what I mean? She, 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 you know what she's talking about. She's talking about partying and, and leaving your kids with Little Fizz. That's what she's talking about. Here, have Little Fizz the simp, the cuck, Little Cuck Fizz, babysit the kids while you go out and be haul. That's what she's talking about, okay? And, and you know, I mean, really, home is this for chicks who don't have kids. Once you get pregnant, it's like, forget it. You know what I mean? Then you already know. Uh, you, you reach the whole finish line. You know what I mean? So you, you need to do something else. You know, uh, go be a good mom instead of, you know, trying to be a hoe or whatever. You know what I mean? Like, it, it's already over. It's over for the hover. You know what I mean? It, it, you, excuse me. I hope that y'all understand what I'm saying because I know that I'm kind of, you know, at a loss for words and so many words because... I didn't prepare for this video. Just turn on the microphone and let it rip. Anyways, I think that April Jones is going through a midlife crisis. What do you guys think about my opinion about what she said? Let me know in the comment section. Thumbs up this video. Click the thumbs up button right now. Click the subscribe button and the notification bell. Click all notifications. Subscribe. Notify all notifications. Thumbs up. Thumbs up. Thumbs up. As Martin Lawrence would say. Say hi to me in the comment section or something. If you can't say anything else, just say hi. But the secret password for this video is, and I know this is a long one because some of y'all are lazy as hell. Some of y'all as lazy as April is crazy. The password to say in the comment section is midlife crisis. Let me know what y'all think about it below. MAGA. Click the subscribe button right now for more Meat Magazine. Click the notification bell all notifications click the thumbs up button on this video post a comment below the video and the comment section be sure to subscribe to all the meat magazine channels for more videos the links to my other channels are in the description box